Hey, what's the commotion? You a loon or something? This night folk country. Night folk? I can handle myself. <laughs> okay. Maybe you should clear out, though, if you're so troubled by things in the night. It's night folk. And I would, it's just... They are my property. Hey, w would you help me uh, get them off? Well, I, I pay you for your troubles. Pay me, huh? Maybe. Show me where this place is. We'll see. All right. Let's go. It's just over there. You good man, partner. <laughs> Them night folk have put me on a pipe. They got their paws on me. Hang me up on a hardwood hammock. Boy, I'm lucky I ain't dead as it is. Night folk. Oh, they bad people. Bad folk. Animals. A lot of them. You know, I ain't never heard no night folk speak. There's not been one peep out of no night folk. Not that I ain't heard it, at least. Imagine not uttering a sound. Can you fathom that? Mm -mm. What kind of evil don't make no sound? It's bad, all right. Bad. I mean, I don't meet many folk out here on my own, for the most part. But I still speak, you know? I talk to myself. Ain't no one else around. Chew my own goddamn ear off. I can imagine. Now, used to be the gators was the worst thing in the bayou. Gators and snakes. I've been snake bit more times I like to remember. Ain't been gator bit, though. Got that to be thankful for, at least. Gator bites is nasty. Mm. Then turtle bites is bad, too. They call them snapping for a reason. I've been known to snap, too. So, how about to keep it down? Oh, yes, partner. Yep. Uh-huh. That's probably best. Oh, hell. Look at that. He fresh. You see what I mean? This night folk work. I knew this fella. Good fella. Didn't deserve this. Now come on. There we go. Up there. Night folk up to all sorts. You go deal with them. I'll be here with my rat gun. Okay. Do what you can. Oh, they got someone. Ooh, poor fella. Oh, too late for him. That's bad juju, all right. Get your reward. Well, boy, that's got to be more of them. Uh, stay here. I'll see. I don't like this. Not at all. Oh no, more! Oh, Out, you devils! Oh. Ah. Ah. It's a bad evil! Away from here! God damn evil. Let's go! 
gotta be them! Okay. They're dead. No oh, well. Okay. I got something for you now. How you doing? Give me a moment. Want it? Here you go, partner. <sighs> what is this? Swamp trash? No, that's some of the good stuff right there. You good man, mister. Damn decent. You might want to bury them bodies. Don't worry about them. Food for the gators. Arthur? Arthur Morgan? Oh, yes. My name is Rangeful. And I'm Jim Milton. John Marston. Oh. Is Arthur... Uh... He passed away. A long time ago. Oh, I'm sorry. He saved my life. He gave his. That doesn't surprise me one bit. <laughs> and you? I know you had tough times. Ah, uh, well... My people aren't really a tribe, we're just a bunch of families, I suppose. But we're in Canada now. It's, uh... What are you doing here? I... I don't really know. My son, I suppose. Oh, he fell. I, I know. I'm sorry. I've got a son. I'm... Very sorry. Oh, it was a long time ago now. Well, it's good to see you, uh, Mr. Marston. <laughs> and you. Uh,
out of here! Come! Here!
Sign this over. I'm gonna take a long time on you. Have to do it. You're gonna do it. You see, we're used to a fight. Hey, untie me, will you? Still breathing, fella? Get these damn ropes off me. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Those goddamn bastards deserve that and more. My wife. You see my wife? Any chance? Yeah, I saw her. West of here. She told me to come find you. Oh. Oh, thank God. But thank you for hearing her call.
Hope your back's ready for this. Yes? Can I help you? Hey! Ah, oh, ah, gah! Hello, chum. Chum? Do you want an autograph? Or a photograph? I'm sorry? People often get nervous, but there's really no need to. I I'm just a, just a normal guy who, well, happens to be very famous. Uh, who are you? Jeremy Gill! Who? The famous fisherman. I've written a lot of books. I'm in the newspaper all the time. Here's one from the New Hanover Gazette from a few years back. And this is a book I wrote. Huh? I wrote it. Good for you. You really don't know who I am? Ah. Oh, well. Nice to meet you. You too. Yeah. John. Sure you don't want a photo? Not right now. You know, mothers, they often offer me their daughters. Just for a photograph? <laughs> no! To marry. But I say no. I'm married to the fish. So you're, you're famous for fishing? Very. And that pays well? Yeah, pretty well. What I mostly do is send fans stuffed fish. Stuffed fish? Yeah. Here, let me show you. Come with me. <laughs> you're selling these? Yes. How many do you want? If you get three, we could do a photograph. Together, like actual friends. No, I'm fine. It's sort of ridiculous. Listen, jump. People love it. And I could sell even more fish if I add them. <laughs> it helps them to know that out there, there's some man fighting with Neptune on a daily basis and winning. Okay. But I can't catch enough of them. And there's really good money in this. I fish a little. You do? Well, in that case, send them to me. Uh, of course, uh, not if they're too rotten. Do you like that bass? I'd sell this for $50. I'd give you 15 Send your fish. Ooh, my card and a map. Maybe I shall. <laughs> Only the decent ones. They have to be at least 24 inches in length and 10 pounds in weight. No one wants to imagine Jeremy Gill catching a tiddler. There's no money in tiddlers. So I hear. Anyone hungry then?
little more. You're quite a fish. Gar, I reckon. Gotcha. Don't fight it. Whoa, it's you. What is wrong with you? We have come to see the rule of law enacted. We will not sit idly by as people take the law into their own hands. And you, today, believe me, you will see the rule of law. I'm not a killer. The... That's just this lady here. Is guilty of multiple counts of murder. Burn in oh, hell, I, you bitch! Posing as a lady of ill friend. repute to lure innocent men. You miserable sow! Stabbing them to death at their most vulnerable. Then disposing of their bodies. She shows no remorse. Neither shall we. Let's go! The time has come for your judgment. No need to wait! Release the floor! Oh, what the God hell? God Let it be known that Valentine is a community of law and order. It's just not right. I tell you, this place is cursed. And today, law and order won out. 
Leave her body here to rot. Jesus. All that excitement, and it didn't cost a penny. Let's go, boy. <laughs> does it gotcha I damn well gotcha shit hmm small mouth You all right? This looks bad. No, I'm not all right. It's real bad. Help me now, or I'm done for. Keep at it. Let's get loose. Oh, 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 oh God. You did it! Praise Jesus! Oh, God. I gotta, gotta grab something for, for the blood. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I was uh, done for it. You saved me. Thank you. Oh, uh, take something from my back for the trouble, though. I'm, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take, a, take a minute now. My leg feels like it's like it's on fire. Drink this for the pain. 
Didn't bring the trap. <sighs> I'd be dead now, if not for you. You kidding me? Yes. <laughs> ah, bluegill. Come on. Hey, come here. Oh, what is this abomination? Professor, where's your creation now?
Can I have a word? Okay, listen. We got something here. Maybe you can help. We're making moonshine, okay? But our last batch was terrible. Set your teeth on edge. Ugh. <laughs> With the right ingredients, maybe. Listen, you fetch us some, maybe there's something in it for you. A reward. What do you think of that? Sounds easy enough. Sure. You hear a gin sing? Grows local. I bet it would taste good. You're in luck. I already have some for you. Go ahead. Throw them into the mixture and we'll see how it turns out. Round on the side of the still. Open the hatch. Well, moment of truth. All right, darling. Let's give this a taste. Mm. Oh, 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 amazing. That is so powerful. You know, our moonshine's gonna be twice as strong with this stuff in it. Strong, huh? Nice. Let's sit on this one and then make another batch later, okay? Well, you did okay, my friend. Help yourself to some moonshine for your trouble, huh? All right. Sounds good. Hey, you robbing bastard! Hope you're ready to die! <laughs> This is just hey, you all right, mister? Can we, uh, can we help you? We survive. I'm That's fine. The most important so. thing. Oh, I know you two. Hey, hey look who it is. Oh. <laughs> I barely recognize you boys on account of you not trying to kill each other. Yeah, well, somebody learned his manners, finally. So you boys didn't run away? Now, nobody looking out here. I reckon we're, we're okay. All right, but the law's pretty... Well, it's pretty vigorous these days. I told you we should want to listen. Oh, no. Mr. High and Mighty, he don't listen to no oh, one. Oh, would you just shut up? I will not. Oh. I will not shut up. You know what? You'll shut up when I shut you up. Oh, that's real funny. I cannot believe it. I'm stuck out here with only you to talk to. I get a better conversation from the goddamn trees. I know. I've seen you talking to them. They should have hanged you for being a moron. You're an unkind man, Mr. Black. Hey. Oh, let me in. Let, let me in. Open the door. Come on, let me in. I'll kill you myself. Go away. Let me in. I, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Now let me in. Go away. I'm so, I'm. I'm I'll make dinner again. All right, I'm, I'm sorry. Say you're sorry again. I'm real sorry.
<laughs> You're the damn fish! You're quite a nice bass. Shit! That's you! All right! You! What do you want? Howdy. You Granger? That's my name. And my occupation, too, if you hadn't noticed. Weren't always that way, though, were you? You used to be a quick draw guy. You knew Jim Boy Calloway. Used to be's correct. Them days are long over. And who might you be? <laughs> Don't matter. Need you to tell me about Jim Boy. Just a quote for a book. A book about Jim Boy? I can't talk to you now. Look at me. A knee deep in hog crap. Ah, don't mind me. We can talk while you work. <laughs> I ain't talking and shoveling. Besides, young man like you would get it done in half the time. Ah, uh, I don't know about that. What's to know? You interested in the old days? If you shovel this shit, I tell you some stories. You keep your hands clean, I don't give you squat. God damn it. Better be some stories. Oh, they are. Pick up the fork and get to work. Or get out of here and stop wasting my time. <sighs> All right. I'll shovel your damn shit. Jim Boy weren't nothing, you know. Me? I killed men, women, and children, too. Animals. I even killed rocks. And I killed them good. I shot folks, stabbed folks. Skinned folks. A scalp song. Boy, they scream when you scalp them. Hey, let me work. Don't know what's got into these hogs, but I know what's coming out of them. <laughs> I bash folks, butchered folks. I burn folks alive. Bury folks alive. One time, I... Hey. I get it, all right? You're me. But what about Callaway? You have no idea, girlie. By a feminine type like you, I'd probably have chopped your head off, stuffed you, and eaten you like a sausage. No doubt. Now it's clean enough to eat off. I guess I'm done. You get that barrel to the shit pile, and I suppose you is. <sighs> all right. No shortage of shit round here. Comes from hungry hogs and no hands. Hell, that stinks. <laughs> All right, I cleaned up your mess. Now go on. 
Tell me about Callaway. I said I'd tell you stories. I didn't say they'd be about him. Don't trifle with me, old man. You knew him. Give me something. Anything. You're making a book, you should make it about me. They're just words is all. Give me a quote and I'll leave you alone. I, you owe me that. Hey, you be careful. A killer like me, it don't take much to end up on the end of my knife. One time... You know I... what? I don't think you're anything at all. Just a crazy old man. I ain't a killer? Well, you'd already be hog feed. I hadn't made a deal with the Federals got this farm. It's your last chance, Mr. Granger. Give me a quote for the book. Hey, hey, hey you don't, you don't hit no man of peace, no government witness. <laughs> Callaway said you were full of piss. He didn't say the half of it. I'm itching to drop you, girlie. Only you ain't worth my time. I, I got too much to lose. Too much to lose. Since I clean this place up, figure I'm in my rights to go ahead and wreck it. Let's see. You don't want to do that? You walk away right now. Well, well. All I wanted was a quote. You don't know who you're trifling with. That's my stick! No. No. No! You didn't know! You just took yourself a regular shit shower, Mr. Granger. Boy, that's real nasty. You earned yourself a killing. And I'm gonna enjoy it now. Draw! It's gonna be the last thing you do. Anything you want me to hold on to? Burning hell! You comfortable? Got everything you need? Not that I care. Yeah! <laughs> 